Van Vliet, a freshman, long three, and he buries it! Before Fred Van Vliet went to the NCAA Final Four, he went to the IHSAs. Just two years ago, Van Vliet led Auburn to a third place finish at state. Last week, he met up with the team after his game at Loyola, hoping to inspire a return trip. I mean, any, anybody can do this, man. You know, there haven't really been that many guys doing what I'm doing, you know, and a lot of kids don't really have that hope or opportunity, so I'm just trying to open up some doors and show them that you can do it. Oh, that's an incredible experience just to know I play with somebody that got to play at the next level. It ain't too often that you get to see somebody that you play with and be on a big spotlight. I hope what it adds for them is just, you know, the opportunity to see big time college basketball game, obviously, and also, you know, to inspire them about what is possible. Anything was possible for Van Vliet against Loyola. He didn't miss a shot all game, tying a career high with 22 points. But Van Vliet's prowess on the court is only half the story. Coach Ott hopes that his Knights will take more valuable lessons off the court. He sets a, a great example both ways of how you're supposed to play the game, the toughness and the intensity, but also how you're supposed to act off the court, to be a person of high moral character, somebody who's a genuinely good person who people like and want to be around. Oh, he's, he's like an entertainer. You know, he's at times he can be very serious, at times he can be really funny. You know, he's, he's just a character, but he's, he's the type of guy that you just love to play with because he's competitive and he just makes people around him so much better. It means the world, you know, and good performance or not, it don't really matter. Just for me to come back and even be able to see them and talk to them, you know, I, I love all those guys like little brothers. While the little brothers are competing for the Nick 10 title, Van Vliet and the Wichita State Shockers are now just two wins away from a perfect season.